welcome to see this video. Previous video discussed the concepts for basis of Node.js and models of Node.js. Now we are discuss about the Node.js file system models. Node.js Node file system model allows us to work with a file system on your computer. On your computer. On your computer, file system related to the work on the using for this Node.js file system model on the use to include the file system model use the to include the file system model use the required method so for that example already all of you already previous class discussed about that lot of built-in models are available in our node.js uh, for that example HTTP models and FS models and OS models and a lot of models are available in uh, node.js but now, now we are discussing about that FS model the first model is also called the file system model this model includes this using the node.js for require method require methods are used to uh, uh, in, I include the file system file system model on the input for the require methods so they use the file system model so they include panicla. for that example var fs equal to require Okay, F plus. This is including for the file system model. The file system model include that they are using the require method. This is FS model. FS models are uh, available in lot of methods. Okay, the common uses for the file system models are uh, to read the files, to create your files, to update your files, to delete files, to read in your files. More file create under the or file read under the or file delete under the or a file of the rename under using this FS module. FS module and I include Pandi. These are the uh, methods are using for this uh, Node.js. Node.js in the day LB use Pandila. First ones are under read files. The read file method used to read on your computer. Read file method is Pana. That's read on your computer. This uh, which methods are? This part is called uh, read. Read file. This method is used to read the file on your computer. On your computer, the file on the read part of the guy using this method. So we use panic. Okay. As we have here, how to read the files? For simple example, how to read the files? If the other file and read panic, display the browser. Browser and our computer contents on the photo display. If the content display on a part of the browser. For that example, first try it. Simply ready for that HTML program. Simply writing for this HTML program. This uh, the every HTML starting tag is must be used for the starting tag HTML and body. The head tag using the my header that display here some header missing and the paragraph tag using the my paragraph. Every HTML uh, every HTML tags must be closing that is must compulsory on the closing tag ready for it or no. This are the very this uh, body tag on the close body no HTML and close body. This saving for this this file names are called the uh, SAM data stable. SAM data. This saved for this file. Next, the JS node JS files. First, the var HTTP is also called a variable name. We go to write the HTTP. HTTP module is also called a built-in model. Hyper text transport uh, protocol modules. This including for this method. Another one is called the var FS. FS equal to file, file system model. This model is mainly used for the, the, to read the files and write the files and create files and rename your files on your computer. That's using the include the this uh, FS method. The FS method include then using the require method. Require method is funny, FS method include particular. Where FS is also called variable name, HTTP is also called variable name. These programs are using, they including the two file system model. Two models are included. One is called file system model, another one is called HTTP model. Okay. The next, the HTTP is accessing for this uh, server. The HTTP dot create server. Create server. These methods are used for the to create a server. The JavaScript files are executing the server to create a server. Server is created. That's using for the server create the, the parameter to use the two parameters are called request and response. Request means the client request the some message and the response the server responds the some message. Okay. That's the FS dot rate file. Already creating for the FS is also called the FS model object. Sorry, FS model variables are called FS dot read file read file methods are used to read the files in our computer read the files on your computer this 
there's a file in sir that is sam dot html already writing for this uh, file sam dot html that we uh, discuss about this uh, program there's another one sir called the function function this call function function this passing this two parameter error error and data uh, suppose this uh, data suppose it uh, isn't passing the any data then some display for that some error message suppose uh, doesn't having this file uh, read the file doesn't having this file Suppose the file is uh, this displaying for this error method. Okay, this res RES means the response method. Response in the right hat. Right hat means that's uh, the server status. St server status 200 means server okay. Okay, then 200 status is okay. That's content type. Display the contents are content text or HTML. Uh, suppose display the contents are used uh, plain text or HTML. So both are used for this. Uh, display the content. Uh, response are right, response are right data. Already this uh, uh, standard HTML read the files, the contents are called stored in for the data. Response are right, these data are called stored in this data are called my header and my paragraph. These data are stored in this data variable. Okay, another one is called response dot and written response dot end means that's displaying some message. The file is read the files then read the file and write the files in our browser is that's the end of the statement is the end of the browser the result to the port port number port number resulting for that our port number let's run this program first this run these programs are called uh, initiate the server server initiate the node the space these filings are called uh, uh, web web dot js js means javascript extension or uh, node web dot js console window you run this program then then initiate the um, initiate the server initialize that another one sir called local host uh, code and 8000 means this is executing for this program display the output star called my header my header my paragraph this display the output this display the output in your browser this is for your uh, node js file system model okay thank you